Thank you for uh, returning to game, guys. We are. I'm continuing to help out my dad on his first time playing through Dark Souls 3. All right, Dad, next order of business. Turn around. We're going to go forward. Oh, Dad, turn see... around. Oh. And go okay. forward through the, right. the archway. Right. Had a little bit of, little bit of jaggy so on my end here, so just, just to let you know. Yeah, I saw just a little bit of it myself, but it went away okay, really then quickly. It might have just been hard drive, Mish. This way? To yes, the left? Yes, we are not going this way after because we took Up out those lizards. To yep. tap those lizards? Yeah, no, remember we took out the lizards in the courtyard area? Yeah. Yeah. So we're going up? Yeah, we're going up now. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right, I we didn't, only I didn't went that, that in that direction the last time to get the lizards, but we got the lizards, and now we're going to go this way. So... This looks like things. All right, so these... about this area... One of these giants, I think one or two of the, one or two of these giants are going to rise up once you walk past him. But then they'll just kind of linger about. If you don't get too close to them, they won't outgrow on you necessarily. There are a so couple So should I just go through this uh, around the side here? Yes. Can I walk while you're talking? Is that or yeah. do you Yeah, you can you can go go forward. There are going to be NPCs you will have like like bulkier NPCs you'll have to fight. Like, oh, yeah, and those are the guys that throw fireballs. Okay, so are there any other... Oh, yes? Kool-Aid man? What Now what am I doing here? Well, oh. now we're fighting the NPCs. Perfect spot because the wall blocks the fireball. <laughs> yep, his hammers are enchanted. That's why they're glowing purple. I believe that's text enchantment. Are these guys or are these computers that I'm These are these here? are computer NPCs. All right, so, all right, so I'm just I was just a little taken aback there. Okay, so all right, so I'm gonna run to the, the side of this court. Is there anything about these guys that I need to? No. Or I just, would say the bet what you should do better. is when you run forward to aggro them, just immediately backtrack back to sort of that little courtyard area. It's okay. a better spot to fight him in. All right. All right. So I. Okay. So no, no special. Okay. All right. Yep. So just go forward, and then immediately go backwards. Like once when they start chasing you, ignore the fireballs. Ignore the giants. So I'll go pick up your souls and then immediately start running back because they will start chasing you at this point. Shit. Hit the wrong thing. Uh, Try to you make got, you got the second quick guy work of this guy. Health is getting low. Keep in mind, Dad, you have a wind-up with your, uh, katana swings. You don't have to get in, like, pressing on top of them. To deliver a weapon swing. You got, you got some reach with your katana, and there's a bit of a wind-up with it. Okay, so I just need to swing, I need to swing quicker. Okay, and I'm not in Ember form, so I'm not going to get... All right, because for some reason, these guys just feel like like real players. Like, they're, Yeah, well, like... actually, these NPCs... So in Dark Souls 3, I believe one of the selling features of this game at the time was that they were going to add one-time spawn NPCs that mimic the combat of actual players from previous Dark Souls games. Like getting, like getting ganked. So, so they are mimicking typical actual PvP player movements. It's like data they collected from like Dark Souls One and Two PvP, plus Bloodborne, I believe. Because actually, Bloodborne and Dark Souls Three both share the same engine. Ah, 
mistiming your attacks. I know. Jesus! Wow, okay. All right, all right. Okay. Fuck these purple wielding dudes. Whatever they're whatever they're banging me with. It looks it looks it looks they are like infused my... with hex enchantments, so I believe they deal increased it's either I think it's increased dark damage. So they do additional dark damage on top of whatever damage their weapons already do. Okay, I don't know what that really means, so it means they do extra it, it means they do extra damage. That's all that's all, right. all you really need to know. The glowing right. purple weapons means they are doing extra damage than they usually would do. Okay. All right. Then and can I just ima can I just assume that any glowing weapon is just worse than non glowing? Yeah, glowing weapons are cuz those are enchantments that are increasing weapon damage with a specific element type typically. So because they're glowing purple, they are using dark magic. Are they're imbued with the dark elements? Shit! Come on, Cap. You're low on health, Dad. Low stamina. Uh, fuck! Wow. Okay, I'm sorry. I was getting, I was getting rambunctious. I was getting, I was getting vigorous. Yeah, these, guys, these guys are just. No, they, they, they hit, man. I mean, I, that's why I was like, it, it was, it's like, if I got, if I got, well, I guess when I, the, the one time I, I got ganked and had to get, well, I didn't get ganked. I got sucked into their thing and then I couldn't drink and all of that shit. I, I didn't know any of the rules, but I didn't ask for it. So. Okay. I just wish I could fight these guys one at a time. <laughs> How much of your Dark Souls life right, or Souls Alright, let's do this, born? Dad. What? When I say retreat back, I mean go, go to the back to get it. Instead of fighting them in the back corner, run all the way back. Oh, okay. Yeah. Now start running back. Ignore him. He will face. He will chase you. But run back. Yeah. Keep right. running. Now what am I doing? What am We're I doing? We're going up the stairs. Up the stairs. We're going up okay. the stairs. Go up the stairs. Okay. Take a left. We are now. Turn around. Let's see if he's still following you. Go back up the stairs. All right, he may have de -aggroed. No, hold on. Oh, there, there they are. There they are. Yep, so they did follow you. But now it's still both of them, right? Yeah, looks like so you are gonna, you're gonna have to fight them both at the same time. Or hang on. Looks like you distracted one of them. All right, there he is. Just back up and heal, Dad. Please keep track of your health. Oh, their weapons are no longer enchanted. Dad, remember the reach and the wind up. Good God, this guy with the poker thing. Nice, nicely timed. Low health, Dad. God! Low health? I can't get away from them! I know I'm just finding a little help. Nice. Just gotta get rid of this one guy. Yep, safety kill. Good choice. Come on until he. Dad and heal. 
All right. Nice. Making good use of the reach. He does not reach because he does have a full arm. God damn it! He only needs one more hit. Oh, I thought you just told me to heal. <laughs> I was wondering if he was actually going to kill you. But on the bright side, he does not respawn after you kill him once. Same thing with this dude. Come on, wind up, you fucker. There it is. Your patience has also somewhat improved. You're doing a good job, Dad. You know, a man who has double the lengthy pole arms, what do you think that says about him and his uh, stature? You think he's overcompensating with two long pole arms? I mean, the average guy would just use one pole arm, but this guy uses two. I wonder. Fucking prick! <laughs> and that is what we have concluded about the gentleman with two pole arms. He is, or was, a fucking prick. God, I was such a fucking mouth breather on that fight. My, my tongue was stuck to my fucking whatever. It's one a tough my fight. Teeth. You needed to focus. All right. Do I need to go and and re re? Up yeah, my... yeah. Go back to the bonfire. Let's Holy let's re up. Shit. The, oh, so those guys the, don't uh, come that, back. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Turn. Sorry, I forgot. I forgot. Go down. Go down. Go down. There's items you can pick up from them. Okay. Oh. Oh shit. Yeah, they drop items. Well, I don't think the other one dropped one. Where did you kill the second guy? It was right in here, or over in here, right? Wow, I don't remember precisely where you... Well, I don't see any, any items, and I killed him down here. Okay, so uh, go, wait, go up the stairs. Go up the stairs to the right. just want to check something. Turn your camera around. Okay, you're good, you're good. Go back to the bonfire. I just want to see if maybe you, you killed him in this area, because I know you at one point get. No, no, I, I killed them both down there. Okay. Yeah, yeah. And that took way too fucking long. Wow, they were, they were hard. They were hard. Are we just coming back here? Are we staying here? I uh, know we're going. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna exit the bonfire. We're just going back to the bonfire to get your your Estes back. No, that's what I thought. That's why I said. Are now we staying we're going here? back out this way. Right. Okay. Yeah. You didn't. You just didn't understand my question. That's all. All right. So we're going back past the giants and all that shit now. Or are we going up yes. those stairs at the other end now? Yes. We are going these, to cross these all the way to the other side. Purple. Purple pole. Assholes. Yeah, well, they're not resp Yeah, so those stairs at the very end on the other side, we're going up those stairs. Okay. All right. I should check back on. Uh, I saw that that video that I showed you about the guy yeah. who was coaching Are his we mom. Is this where we're going? Yeah. Here. I'm playing okay. Dark Souls. Okay. I wonder how yeah. far she actually made it in the game. All right, so here's what we're gonna do. Sorry, I'll get back to this bit later. No, you no, wanna, go back okay. to the oh, bottom. Okay. All right. So let, let okay. Yeah, because I was, you know, do you want to stop and just? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm trying to be less. Okay. Go, Dad. Dad, back down the stairs, please. Okay. Well, you, that's the first time that you said I was going I in the said wrong direction. at the bottom floor. Anyways. I I didn't I'm sorry. hear I, at the I bottom floor. I should have been more specific. Do you see where the the glowy orange marks are? Yes. Turn the, to the wall on the left. No, no, this? yes, that wall. Now hit it. Okay, now we're going to go down the ladder. Now 
You found the secret passageway. To what? Okay, so yeah, well, you're laughing. You're laughing stop, stop like there's going to be something. Stop for a minute. Don't don't go forward. Don't go forward. Pan to the camera around, but leave your character still. Do you see the creature in the corner? Yeah. There's two creatures in total. That's one of them. The other creatures in the other corner. We're gonna inch forward until one of them aggro's and charges you. Because if you inch forward, you don't just charge into the room. You only have to fight one at a time. And then come back here and fight yeah, it? Yeah, come back, come back. Yeah, right here in front of the ladder. Where, so and where's the forward, other one? Inch forward. Where's inch the other forward. one, though? I just uh, want to know where... Good, that's a good question. Robin. Oh, over oh there. okay. That, okay. Yeah, left side. Oh, he's he's peeking at me like a girlfriend. He's peeking at me like a chick that, that wants my phone number. Which one am I going to aggro first? This one, uh, probably. That one, yeah. the, the girlfriend that wants your phone number. Okay. Yeah, no, go back to the, towards the ladder. Oh, We're going to fight shit. him here. That's why we, uh, oh yeah, they do, they hit pretty hard. Uh, what the fuck is he doing? He's breathing lightning. I... Okay, he can breathe lightning, that's good to know. There you go. Yep, just kind of stick on, on, on his, like, kind of underneath him, but also heal when you can. Yeah, this guy will kill you in three hits. Okay, I got it. Ooh. Fuck! Yep. I, I was getting too greedy. I was getting too well, greedy. Well, the problem... I... So, what you could have done there... The idea was correct. The execution was just improper. I was so running what, out of stamina. This is kind I, of an advanced strat, but what I would have done there was I would have de-locked from him so I, it wouldn't push me into the lightning breath as much, and okay. I would just kind of free aim attack him. Okay. Or at least I'll, if you're locked onto him, stay away from the lightning, but, like, yeah, you had the correct idea. Okay. You needed to take a, you needed to take an extra half second, though, to sidestep to the left so the lightning wouldn't hit you. I, I, I didn't, I don't know him well enough to know that I couldn't get close to him. When the, remember, I went from the world of you can't get close to the boss to you can be on top of the boss. But you've but been then, in the world of you can, you can kind of get hit by the boss. Robin, Robin, I wasn't saying that you were wrong on anything. I was just I saying that it's a learning experience and now I know. Go up the stairs. All right, down the letter, let's try this again. Uh, I gotta get my souls too, right? That's probably the other nice thing about fighting in here is that you can get your souls before you... Okay. Yep. All right, girlfriend! Okay, right. girlfriend! How you He's doing fucking... there? Yeah, I'm, I would not want to aggro. You haven't responded to my texts. I would not want to aggro. More than one of the. Well, come on, George. What's going on? Wait, it's a dude that's it's a dude that's stalking you. I thought this was an ex-girlfriend. Of course, her name's either okay. Tiffany. What did he? T oh, that's the grab. Oh, move. he's like he's like that. Right, get, get ready to dodge and then heal. Okay, just stabilize. I gotta, I gotta lock onto him because I. Yeah, I, I was, can't. About, I, I was waiting for you to do that. Were you just having yeah, I, I just fuck. Okay, I, I gotta get back in there. I gotta lock onto him and just deal with staying away from him when he, when he, when he zaps.